it, it's such a silly tradition, actually, to split people up by gender. It's about tribes coming together. And so if you're best friends with the bride and you're a man, you should be on the bride side. Um, but as <laughs> we didn't rehearse the recessional, but as we were walking off two by two, um, you know, the groom the, traditionally is holding out his arm for the, you know, each, each bridesmaid as, as they go. And I was face to face with this lovely man, friends with the groom. And I was like, hmm, I, and I, and I know you, you are a fan of improv um, and a practitioner of improv, so you'll appreciate it. But I was like, I, I, I had this improvisational moment where I was like, you know what, I'm going to offer him my arm. And I did. And I, and I think what my instinct was, um, which was effective, was to, uh, to make the, the, disc, the inevitable discomfort one of uh, focus focus on the actual event and what it was about as opposed to um, the uh, the surface appearance of it. Because on the surface, it just looks like, okay, he's trying to squeeze into the wrong size shoe. He's trying to be a bridesmaid. Um, and that makes us uncomfortable. But if you mix it up, then you're just focused on the event. The, the, you know, the tradition doesn't matter. You've exploded the tradition. And, and I thought, this is a great idea to talk about, a great way to talk about this idea of exploding uh, gender roles. 